What is this? I'm ready for the wasteland right now. Hey yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy and welcome back to another video. Today we are back on Wish. We are back buying some more, ah, well this whole thing is random, yes. We've got a little more focus today than usual. Normally I'm just kind of scanning around looking for whatever, but today I'm still scanning around looking for whatever, but within a specific category. As you guys saw, today we are buying all the masks on Wish. As you guys know right now, there's a lot going on in the world where I live currently. Masks are mandatory when you go out in public. And well, there's a, a lot of variety of different types of masks. Are they good? Are they bad? Do they even do the trick? There's so much speculation back and forth. So you know what? Go ahead. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section down below. That might have been a bad idea, but who cares? But regardless, they are mandatory. So we need them. And I have a very limited selection of masks right now. And since it's basically like a major clothing accessory right now, I I figure I need to spice it up and get something new to add to my wardrobe. Maybe be prepared for if things get worse and I need a more heavy duty mask. I don't know. But the point is I need to get prepared. So we're going to none other than wish.com and we are going to be buying every mask that we see. <sighs> okay, so we've got we've got it open right now and right off the rip, I see two masks. It's like it's prepared for me. The KN95 mask. This looks very unique. I've never seen one like this, but it's got some really good ratings. Good fit, good arrival time. Oh, they even have custom photos very very interesting okay well the title of the video is I buy all the masks I see so I'm buying it okay this looks pretty standard I feel like I've seen something like this before let's cop this in black as well is this a mask or just 10 piece yeah whatever sure add it to cart okay what do we have here rush delivery you love to see it it says it's a bicycle motorcycle ski cycling anti-pollution oh, okay there we go that's what we we're looking for the blue looks kind of cool I'm yeah let's get that nice oh whatever I'm just buying it I'm not even thinking about this <laughs> what is this? Oh my god. All right, you know what guys? I'm gonna say right now 30,000 likes and I'm gonna buy this electric mini scooter foldable adult student scooter <laughs> It's 500 bucks, so it's not cheap. So 30K likes, smash the like button, and I'll buy that in a future video. But let's, okay, I'm gonna refocus. Okay, what? This is taking mass to a whole new level. We've got the mobile lung protection against smog, portable, breathable, dustproof, electric sports mask. That is intense. I guess this is like a, a level up. Not only are you protecting yourself, but you're also getting air in. Is that what's going on here? It looks like she puts it, this girl has it on her arm and it's like pumping air into her mask. So it's more breathable. It's got four and a half stars on the reviews. All right, well, I'm gonna try it out and I'm gonna, we're gonna find out if it if it is better. Maybe this is what we should all be going for. I know a lot of people complain they can't breathe properly when they have a mask on. Well, maybe this is a solution. Uh, this one's interesting. It's a bullet mask, men's punk rock biker custom costume hip hop motorcycle. It does have very high reviews. Wow, this guy looks great. That's scary. Okay, I feel like the intimidation factor with this mask is very high. I don't know about the uh, health and safety factor, but gotta buy all the masks to see. So uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna add that to the cart. We got some. Oh oh, this is some some uh, some dark looking vibes. I'm gonna add that to the cart. Ooh, this looks kind of ham. The thing is, some of this might not come in too, guys. So I'm just gonna order as many as I possibly can because you know with everything going on, it takes longer for items to arrive. So some of these might not show up. Some of them might. I don't I I don't know. I'm gonna just buy like. 40 of them and uh, hopefully we get something. Okay, what do we have here? These are the stock, the standard, 100 pieces for 18 bucks. That's a big vibe. Add that to the cart. Yo, this, this is intense. Silicone face piece respirator 6800 full face gas mask. Like I said, taking it to the next level. Who knows what could happen? You gotta be prepared for any and all scenarios. You know what I mean? Give me the, give me the whole whatever. I want it all. Okay, we've got like six or seven masks so far, but I, there's a lot more left. And I've been enjoying making a little bit of a mystery vibe to this where you guys don't know exactly what I'm gonna get because you see me buy it all. So I'm gonna buy half right now that you saw and then I'm gonna buy some more and you're not gonna see it and it's gonna be a surprise when it all comes in. So get ready for some even crazy, we already have some pretty crazy looking masks, but get ready for some even crazier looking masks when I actually do the unboxing. So I'll, uh, I'll see you guys then. All right, ladies and gentlemen, all of our packages have arrived and it is time to see what these wish masks look like. I'm really curious what's inside. Like, how's, I, anyways, let's just see what we got. I'm gonna move everything down. Oh my God. We are starting off with a bang. I don't know if this is a protective mask or a, I'm kind of nervous to put it on. <laughs> oh God. 
Oh, this is, uh, this is interesting. Okay, I feel like we should rate things based off like, you know, function, breathability, how, how good it looks. Firstly, there's two holes in the front. So I don't know if that's really gonna serve the purpose of protecting you during these times. I feel like that defeats the purpose. So I'm, I'm gonna say that's probably not the most useful. It's still very hard to breathe and it's kind of like a leather material. So people are like struggling with breathing into a mask already. This is gonna be quite a bit worse. But intimidation factor, pretty high. If I saw you wearing this, I would, I would, I might like go in the other direction, you know what I mean? But there's, this could be like a multi-use thing. Maybe you're into some stuff and I don't judge is all I'm gonna say. So, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. It's, we're starting off with a bang. We're gonna see some weird stuff today. Okay, let's see what our next one is. I think it's gonna be hopefully a little more functional. This is, it says KN95 and it says good mask. So it's gotta be good. It's gotta be good, it says good mask. Sometimes we gotta do some boring thing. Whoa, that's pretty intense. I don't know how all this is gonna work. A bunch of pads that you can use, swap them in and out. Oh, I did not think that was coming out. So you take that out, you put this in. Oh, I feel like this is some heavy duty stuff right now. The string part is really what's gonna throw me off though. I can already tell, like, come on, G. Okay, I think we got this set up. This might actually be kind of a vibe. Kind of, I don't know, not really, no. I feel like this is like a baby face mask. It's also really not comfortable. I feel like it's supposed to give you a complete coverage and com like stick to your face so that there's no areas that's leaking out, but it doesn't really do that and it's just uncomfortable. I had high hopes after this little like insert. I mean, do I look like a ninja? I feel like I look kind of like a ninja. A little bit? No! Well, it's definitely interesting. I like that they come with a bunch of filters that you could swap in and out whenever you need them, but I don't know, it just doesn't fit well enough for me. Maybe for certain people, this is the perfect fit and it would be a big vibe, but for me, it, it's a no-go. Do it? It's just my beard. You make me insecure. He's trying to bully me back. You're old. <laughs> you can't bully me back. <laughs> Next item. This looks interesting, okay? This says on it, respirator. Like a ventilator or something? I don't know. <laughs> I might've bought a ventilator off wish. This thing looks intense. Oh dear. This is a heavy duty mask. Oh my God. You're good in this. You're good. I'm telling you right now, if I lived in the States, this might be what I'd be wearing when I went out. That came off really smooth. I'm not gonna lie. I was like holding in doing a, ah, because it was an Apple product. There we go. <laughs> Yo, this is heavy duty. If things get worse, I'm prepped. Damn boy, I'm ready. Ah. <laughs> Why does it sound like I'm talking through a radio? Damn, this is definitely the thumbnail. Can you guys hear me? Hit the like button if you can. Whew. It's pretty comfortable. It, it is like immersive, like your whole face is in it. So that's kind of a lot, but it's comfortable around the sides. Like it completely seals you in and it doesn't hurt. I'm sure you would get marks if you wore this for long enough. Like, I feel like this might be a little bit for show. This like main front area, like there's fully holes here. So I don't really think this is gonna do all that much. It looks like it would be heavy duty and it would do the trick to the most extreme level, but I'm not 100% sure. Let me know what you guys think down below. I'm gonna do a test, okay? I think salt is gonna go through this. Okay, the salt didn't go through. Now it's stuck. My theory was incorrect. Okay, I've got a plan. I'm gonna light this candle here. And if we can blow out the candle with the mask on, it's not doing its job. So let's find out. It doesn't work. It's uh, breaking up my stream of air so that it's not completely blowing it out, but it's moving it. So obviously air is getting through. Looks great. And you would probably trust this to save your life from a variety of different diseases, but you shouldn't. From at least our very not super scientific test, it doesn't actually work. Maybe this is just supposed to be like a cosplay thing. It's just a costume item. Oh wait, we should test this too. <laughs> Okay, so this one, we get a little bit of air through, but it doesn't completely blow it out. So what we've been told is that technically from COVID, this would protect you. But with this one, you might be protected from coronavirus, but you're, you're not protected from everything else that you would assume you would be protected with. You know, I, I would figure this would like survive mustard gas and stuff, you know, like I don't think that's the case. All right, our next mask looks like a Sub-Zero from Mortal Kombat mask. Kind of a vibe. It comes with some replacements. This is kind of a vibe. Aesthetically, I feel like... Do I look like Sub-Zero? Finish him! Anyways, it's kind of hard to breathe. I'm a little out of breath right now. Let's see what happens. It's doing nothing. Like... 
aesthetically, I think this is our best looking one. It's just like squeezing my nose. This is a full nose plug that you put on top. So they're going hard with this one. I, I think this is our best one yet, but I, I would be worried about uh, all day usage. Next item. This one's called a veil. Oh baby. Oh baby. This one's good. I'm, I'm even hiding it from Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's jokes. Some Tiger King vibes, ladies and gentlemen. This one's pretty comfy. Okay, we got the filter in. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. This does feel pretty like thick and heavy duty. Plus, you're adding in a filter, so you got that extra protection. Oh no, this one might be the best. You got the protection, the power of the tiger to fight off the COVID. That's a good battle right there. It is pretty out there. It's pretty in your face. It might be kind of cringe. Like if you're just walking around, people look at you, they're like, he's doing that, right? You're that guy. You're the tiger guy, eh? I don't know how I feel about that. Joe Exotic, for sure, would be rocking this. But me, I don't know. What do you guys think? Would you wear this? Jay, would you wear this? I feel like if they did an ugly masks party, the same way you do like an ugly Christmas sweater party, this would be a bang. But for everyday usage, I might go back to Sub-Zero. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below. Let's see what our next mask is. Okay, our next mask is um, very large. So I don't know if we're gonna get some more heavy duty stuff out of this, or maybe this is just like a bunch of masks. I'm not sure, but we're gonna find out together, folks. <laughs> I went a little overboard with this one, okay? It's a helmet, but it, it's a mask because it covers everything. It's gonna look like Darth Vader or Bane. Here's our, uh, our tactical helmet. So this is like extra protection against a variety of things. Multi-use is, is what I'm gonna call this. Oh, God damn. There's definitely some good protection for your mouth and breathing area here, but you got all this extra protection. Yeah, nothing. You're also gonna probably get a neck workout because like it's pretty heavy and your vision is very limited. It's hot in there. I don't know for sure, but I think this has a GoPro attachment. That's pretty lit. Oh shit. This is some zombie apocalypse shit right here. Like this is, I'm 100% rocking this. If a zombie apocalypse happens, this is the first thing I'm putting on. Did I get two of this tactical helmet? No. Why did I get two? I think I accidentally hit order two. <laughs> that's literally the exact same. <laughs> why did I do that? Oh, it's a different color. Maybe that's why I really, I liked it enough to get two colors. Oh, this one's kind of wavy. Bam. What do you think? This one's bigger? All right, this is the khaki one and this is the black one. I think it'd be pretty fun. If you guys want to see me and Jay do a little paintball battle one of these days, be sure to let me know in the comment section down below. Should we shoot a bow and arrow at it? All right, guys, we're going to shoot it. It's your leg along. Oh, baby. Oh my God. That is not very tactical. A nice little indent on your cheek. That was a snipe. Like, I don't know if it hit here, if it would have gone through as well. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, let me try again. Oh, that was right on the eye, I think. That was minimal damage. I'm impressed. Oh! In the middle. Right in the nose? Bounced off. I'm gonna put it on. You can shoot. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, we got another weapon. This one's gonna shoot a lot harder, and I, I, I don't know what's gonna happen, but I'm taking cover. Uh, me too. Missed it. <laughs> oh, that did work. Yeah. Oh my God, that's it? Saying this would protect you. You wouldn't have died. You might've got a concussion, but you wouldn't have died. I'm impressed. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Okay. <laughs> You're dead. You're dead, dead. You're dead. It popped the whole thing out. Yo, yo, yo. It didn't even break it. it. Didn't break it, but it still popped it out. And imagine having this on. That would be insane. Like you have this on and then poop, but you're good. This little thin thing saved your life. So that's where the dent is. And it did with shot. I'm impressed. Uh, these are these are pretty legit tactical helmets. I mean, you don't run into crossbows, bone and arrows too often these days. I don't think it would protect you against a bullet, but there's some level of protection here. So you know what? I got an idea. In the soap. What? It's a more realistic, like you might run into someone with a bat. You'd be pretty messed up. <laughs> oh my God. This is the one you'll wear when we play paintball, okay? <laughs> All right, next item. Okay, mask times one. What do we got here? We're getting funky again, folks. I don't even know what that is. It's just a design. Again, very aggressive design choice. Not sure how I feel about that or that I would feel comfortable wearing this out in public. But if you really want to express yourself and, you know, rock something crazy with your mask, then this is, this is pretty wild. You'll get some good looks with this one. And it does feel like it's got some pretty good protection. Fits pretty well, feels relatively comfortable. And it does the trick. It's a slightly different design than the Sub-Zero mask because that had straps that went over your ear to really make sure it doesn't fall down. This one isn't cutting off my nasal passage quite as much as the uh, Sub-Zero mask, but basically same design. 
fashion mask. Maybe this is the first one I could actually wear out in public. Simple, black, it looks kind of like Jay's. How do I look? I feel like of all of them, this is the most casual that I could wear out and about, but I'm worried about protection right now. We're gonna find out. Maybe your mask hasn't been doing much this whole time. <laughs> No, we're good, we're good. I'm impressed. I don't know if this is a really scientific test, but this is just what we're using. So do not take this as a proof that you're good, okay? It's just an eyeball test. This is definitely the best one so far in terms of something I would actually wear. I think we could do better. Let's see what we got next. Okay, this says breathable portable. It's an interesting item. Ooh, it's got a Nike swoosh on it. This is looking promising, folks. Oh, it's something. It's a mask of some kind. Holy hell. This is some next level. What? Okay. All right. We've got some uh, some research to do right now. Is this like pumping air in? Oh, whoa. It's like a big mouse. Okay. This is the mask. So you'd have this on. Full non-English manual. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. It's turned on. So we got that attached. Okay. 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 How's this work? I'm just trying to put pieces <laughs> together. It's like Lego. Ooh, it's blowing air on me. Oh my Lord. <laughs> Yo, I'm ready for the wasteland. <laughs> I'm ready for the wasteland right now. I'm ready to go. So this is giving me some yeah. fresh air vibes exactly. while I'm still wearing a mask. I do feel like I'm getting some fresh air in here right now. Do I look a little crazy? Yes. Like if you saw me, what would you think? Like you just came out from the hospital. I definitely had the disease and I'm, yeah. I'm like fresh <laughs> out walking around. I need air. We did not get normal masks. And I know you probably saw this video and you're like, well, what is he gonna do? Just unbox like 20 of these? Like that's boring. Nope, not on this channel. So be sure to subscribe because this is the only place you get content like this. Nobody else is doing this video. I'm calling it right now. Well, maybe after this, somebody will. As of right now, we're the only ones. Okay, let's see if we have any more items. This might be our last one. It looks like a simple black mask. Same exact style as our Tiger King one from earlier. Even that wasn't actually Tiger King, but it's just black, which is way more of a vibe. Let's test it out. Oh, that's that's pretty clean. Um, this might become my new go-to mask. I actually kind of need one. I've just been using those like medical ones non-stop you gotta check vibes we should probably check this one too Bob, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this was interesting. It was very different. Uh, uh, like, yes, it was Wish, but that was about the only thing that's similar to anything we've done in the past. I was very curious to see what type of masks we could find on Wish, and we found a wide, wide variety of masks, as you can tell. Like, what, what is this? Now, I'm not sure about everybody, but where I live, masks are now mandatory, so I figured it was a good idea to find out what our options were, and I've, I've learned a little bit, and I've learned that I also don't know much. So, that's, I feel like that's normally the case, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to smash the like button. Stay safe out there, ladies and gentlemen. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Toodles!